Hello and welcome to today's Facecast. Today we're in the book of Psalms. Here's a psalm that says something about the life that we live and how we live it, the attitude we should have. So much of scripture is about attitude, the attitude that God has towards us, our Father in heaven, towards us, his people on earth, the attitude that Jesus, our saviour and leader, has for us, the attitude we have to each other, our attitude, all, all about attitude. Attitude debar, um, determines many things, doesn't it? The way that we think about things and the way that we treat other people. This is from Psalm 91, verses 1 and 2. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Now, it'd be very easy to, to recite that, to reel it off as a, a statement of faith, of belief, and no more. But it is much more than that. Look at that first part. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High. To dwell somewhere is to live, to have your being, to spend your time, to invest yourself in this place or this time, to dwell somewhere. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High. That is, in the protection of, for one thing, that's what a shelter is, it protects you from the rain or something. He who dwells in the shelter of, but also under the auspices of, or under the influence of, is another way of putting it, or under the control, maybe, but not such a good word, under the um, guidance of the Most High. He who dwells, lives and has their being in the shelter that is under the influence and direction of the Most High. If you just take those two words literally, the Most High, well, it would be, wouldn't it? If the Most High person in your world was the chief of police, perhaps, or the, what do we call them now, the superintendent of the county or something like that, um, if you dwell under their protection, then you're going to be very well protected. If you dwell under the protection of the law, then you should be well protected. So if you're dwell, because those things are the most high that we have, our courts of law, they are everything to us. And our spiritual court of law is the seat, the throne of Jesus Christ with his father in heaven. He who lives in the protection of the person who is most influential will rest in the shadow of the almighty. So we will have a place to rest, repose, take care, be at ease in the shadow of, under the influence of, the Almighty. There is nothing mightier than God. It's hard for us to convey God, isn't it, and to think about God. We have to think about Jesus in order to see God. That's why Jesus was sent in the first place. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I, he turns to, the psalmist now turns to say, I will say of the Lord, this is what I say and what I think, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. If we could say nothing else each day than that short phrase, then we would be reasserting our belief and our faith in God Almighty and in Jesus our Saviour. And it is, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. It's a wonderful saying, isn't it? Say it with me. He is my refuge and my fortress my God, in whom I trust. Amen to that. Bye for now.